Hello, Mr. Thompson. How are you doing? Thank you very much for taking my call. Just a quick one. I've got a letter come through the post saying I'm being negligent. How so? Yeah, for taking Charlie and the missus away on a holiday to Rome, of all places. In term time? In, well, it was in term time, yeah. It's a fu- got to pay 80 quid. 80 quid fine, yeah. And if I don't pay it within 21 days, it'll be 160. Sounds pretty negligent to me. It's still really negligent, you say? Well, I know you're doing Rome and, and you know, the Romans in school now because I communicate with my with my boy and uh, yeah he loves that topic so I thought you know what I'll take him to Rome I'd look at the prices that are uh, over half term uh, and to go to Rome for four days costs roughly around about oh, four thousand five hundred pounds for that for the family yeah but if I go if I go in school time cost me 550 quid piece of cake flights included yeah so I thought you know what no brainer what I'll do is I'll go then he'll go with a beautiful magical wonderful holiday that he's never gonna forget and uh, and it'll be more cost-effective because let's face it 3k is a little bit outside of my uh, my price bracket mr. Thompson I don't know what it's like for yourself still need to pay the fine still gonna find me right okay what, um, missed geography? Nymph- we missed he missed out on geography well, it's funny you say that, actually, Mr. Thompson, because we're in a new new land, so he discovered new geographical locations, which is wonderful. And also, I got him to plan routes to go around the Colosseum and stuff. It was brilliant. Yeah, I know he's building shields in... I know he's building a shield in um in class, but get, he actually held a real-life shield. Right. Yeah, in Rome. It was brilliant. I went to the Vatican. Still need to pay. Br- still going to find me, though. Yep, negligent. Yeah. Negligent, yeah, I can, I can see how that could be negligent to a to a degree. Giving my son a wonderful magical holiday, um, where he actually learnt more stuff. Also, guess what? He was ordering food in English. I know you do English in school and Italian. Brilliant. When are you going to pay? Still going to find me. Afraid so. Yeah. Right. Okay. Probably worth taking the hit though, isn't it, Mr. Thompson? To be honest, what would you do? Wouldn't take my kids out of school. Keep them in school. Keep them. Keep them in the shut room for. Uh, yeah, for six hours a day, all facing all one direction. You, that's that's how kids learn these days, though, isn't 100%. it? Yeah, not moving around and having fun and whatnot. No, it's just... Right, I've got you. Okay. Uh, it'll be a straight no 160 worries. fine um, next time. Say that again? It'll be a straight 160 fine next time. And if I do this again within three years, the fine won't be 80. It'll be straight away 160. That's correct. Wow. That's a, <laughs> That's a bit... That's a bit much, do you not think? Sure, it's a school, not a business. Yeah? A controlling business? No? All right, Mr. Well, no worries. I'll, uh, I'll fork out the 80 quid.